Today, we're gonna look at the most expensive items we can find on eBay. And because this channel is all about music, we're gonna focus on music-related stuff. Now, you may be wondering, why are we doing this? Well, honestly, because I'm bored and I had nothing else better to do today. Hey friends, welcome to Vinylize. I'm Jarrett New, and today we're going to look at the most expensive music and audio related items on eBay. So basically stuff like turntables, cassette decks, reel-to-reel -reel players, CD players, speakers, and basically any other thing I can think of. But before we dive in, I got something super cool I wanted to share with you guys. Recently, several of you reached out to me on Twitter and told me about the fact that a German record label called Pias Germany is going to be releasing for the first first time ever the incredible album Boren und der Club of Gore Sunset Mission on vinyl. Now if you guys have been watching my videos for a while you'll already know that I am completely obsessed with this album. In fact I'd say it's one of my top 10 favorite albums of all time. It's that good. And basically it has this incredible dark jazz noir feel that's perfect for late night listening or meditation. I mean, I personally, when I listen to it, I picture an old black and white movie where the detective is near the window and it's raining and you can see the reflection of the rain off of his face, you know, and he's smoking a cigarette and he's drinking a glass of single malt scotch and he's kind of dreaming about his long lost lover, you know, the blonde that got away. And to top all of this imagery off, there's even sounds of thunder and rain in the mix. So it's definitely an album that really gets inside your head and stays there. And if you don't believe me, I highly encourage you to check it out on YouTube for yourself and listen to the whole thing start to finish. I'm gonna have the link down below if you guys wanna check it out. It's gonna blow you away. So anyway, that's why I am so glad it is finally coming to the vinyl format. Now it's gonna be released next month on November the 11th, this year, 2016. So if you wanna pre-order it like I did, then I'm gonna have that link down below in the description as well. Now, when you go to their website, because everything is in German, you're gonna to have to go to the top of the page and click switch to English. And you'll also notice that the price is gonna be 24.99 euros, which if you live over here in America, currently that's about $27.50. Not too bad considering this is an extremely rare item that will probably be sought after by collectors for years to come. And when everything was said and done, my total price, including shipping, came out to about $37. So I cannot wait to get that sucker in the mail next month. All right, now let's find some expensive stuff on eBay. Okay, so first off, we're gonna start with the turntable. And to find the most expensive one, you gotta go up to the top where it says sort and click price plus shipping highest first. And then the most expensive stuff will be at the very top. Okay, so these are industrial turntables, which is not exactly what we had in mind. So let's just keep scrolling till we find a vinyl turntable. All right, nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay, here we go. Here's a turntable from Germany that's $38,000. Yeah, that seems very reasonable. Let's see what that's all about. Oh no, it's used. That sucks. I guess you gotta spend at least 40 grand if you want the new stuff. All right, so let's take a look at this thing. Well, first off, it looks very well supported. It's got those large pillars that act kind of like a suspension system. And I've noticed that seems to be a theme with high-end turntables. You're not just getting the record player, but you're also getting the base in which it sits on. And speaking of those pillars, they don't really look all that interesting. I mean, the overall color pattern of this turntable is black on black, which honestly looks kind of boring. So for 38 grand, we get a used turntable with boring legs and no dust cover. Sounds like a bargain to me. All right, now let's see what happens when you type record player into the search box. Okay, at the bottom of the screen, there's a really cool looking laser turntable, but unfortunately it's only a measly 16 grand. <sighs> that is way too cheap for our purposes in this video. So we're gonna look at the one above it, which is 22 grand much better and this thing looks really cool so let's see what we get for that price okay so this is a very high-end turntable and unlike the last one this one actually looks pretty cool it's got a nice polished silver gold and copper appearance that really stands out and overall it's got a very sophisticated space age feel to it and apparently a lot of other people like it as well because there are currently 87 other people looking at this thing 
online. But unfortunately for the seller, no one has yet to take the plunge and click the little buy it now button and pick up that sucker for the full 22,000. But I do like the fact that it's brand new, unlike that other turntable, but yet again, no dust cover. That's a shame. Anyway, let's move on to cassettes. All right, here we go. Let's sort everything the exact same way and see what we get. Okay, the first thing that shows up is this weird looking clear case Nakamichi thing for 20,000. Now, when it comes to cassette decks, Nakamichis are the cream of the crop. They're basically like the Cadillacs of the cassette world. So let's take a look at it. All right, well, as I mentioned, this version looks very different than the other Nakamichi tape decks out there because this one has a clear case and the overall shape of it doesn't fit the standard rectangular enclosures that are common among normal cassette decks. Kind of like this one right here. And the reason it looks so weird is because it seems this was a very rare, fully functioning prototype that Nakamichi made. So this thing might actually be the only one of its kind, and that's why it's so expensive. But all the parts on the inside look like they're in mint condition. So I'm sure it would perform just as well as a normal Nakamichi. And even better, it comes with a dust cover. Hallelujah, finally. So for 20 grand, we get a great deck and a dust cover. We'd be crazy not to buy it. All right, so we got a record player and a cassette deck, but it's not enough. Our shopping spree is just getting started. So how about we burn through a little more cash and check out some reel-to-reel -reel players. All right, now as of the making of this video, my current reel-to-reel -reel player is back from the shop and I'm gonna make a video about it very soon, but for the meantime, since we're making it rain, let's just go ahead and buy another one. And of course, it has to be the best and most expensive one we can find on eBay. Those are the rules. So we'll go ahead and type reel to reel player in here and see what we get. All right, high is first. Okay, so the first one that pops up are two large reel to reel players side by side for $3,600. But since we're only looking for a single reel to reel player, we're gonna pick the one right below that. All right, this is the Technics 1500 two track reel to reel player, and it's going for 2,590 bucks. Now for this list, that's a little on the cheap end, so I really hope it's not a piece of crap. Anyways, here's a few close-up photos of it, and overall, this thing looks like it's in great condition. I mean, it's practically mint. And it also comes with its original hubs and a beautiful cherry wood finish that looks really, really nice. And if you guys are already familiar with the Technics 1200 Mark II turntable, then you'll already know that this brand makes some really high quality audio stuff. And this reel-to-reel -reel player is no exception. But when it comes to reel-to-reel -reel players, the absolute best, in my humble opinion, is the Pioneer RT909. Everywhere I look online, people are saying, great things about it. So let's see if we can find one of those. Yet again, arranged by the highest price, and here are the two most expensive ones. They both look fantastic, but this one up here in black looks absolutely gorgeous. So let's see why it costs $3,500. Okay, well first off, it says that it's in mint condition and that it's been fully serviced. So even if it did have some problems in the past, they've all been taken care of now, which is nice. And as a side note, there's 110 other people currently looking at this thing, which is pretty damn awesome for any eBay listing. And if we look down at the specs, we see that the black color is completely custom because usually these RT909s only come in silver. So it's been repaired, overhauled, oiled up, and basically it's in mint condition. Also, it says the heads were polished to a mirror shine, the belts and pinch rollers were replaced, and it even comes with two metal reels and two hub adapters, as well as a one-year warranty on parts and labor. How freaking cool is that? You even get a warranty even though it's a used item. And here are some photos of what it actually looks like up close. And this thing is incredible. It's got a really nice matte black color, and there's not a single scrape or scratch on it. And those tape heads do in fact have a beautiful mirror shine to them. So I guess that 3500 is definitely worth it for such a rare luxury item. All right, now let's move on to eBay's most expensive CD player. Okay, it looks like the Esoteric K01X is gonna be our clear cut winner because at a whopping 15 grand, it's definitely not a lightweight. So let's check it out. Okay, so we got two people watching it, so clearly not as much interest here as that last reel-to-reel -reel player we saw, but this is, in fact, not just any CD player. It's also an SA CD player, 
which stands for Super Audio CD Player, and the Super Audio CD was a format that had much higher resolution than normal CDs, but unfortunately, it didn't last that long. Anyways, let's see what's in the box. All right, we get the remote, power cable, and the manual, as well as, of course, the player itself. And that thing looks really nice. I don't know if I'd pay 15 Gs for it, but it does look very sleek and modern. And here are some photos of the connections in the back from a couple of different angles. And if we check out their description below, they claim to take sound to the X dimension. Now, I don't know exactly what that means, but I'm sure this thing would sound pretty good provided you had the right gear. And speaking of gear, to listen to this awesome music, we gotta pick up some luxury speakers, so yet again, let's hunt down the most expensive ones. All right, looks like our winner is the Bang & Olufsen Biolab 5 Black Acoustic Lens speakers, which come in at a wallet-breaking 45 grand. Now, these things look really weird, so we gotta check them out. Okay, we got 38 other people watching these speakers online, but as of yet, no one has smashed that Buy It Now button which I don't understand why, because by their own admission, these are stunning speakers. But they only included one actual photo of them, which is really disappointing. I mean, if I'm gonna drop 45 grand on something, at least give me a couple of close-ups, damn. And to top it all off, their description, let's just say leaves much to be desired. All right, now I was gonna end the video right here, but then I remembered laser discs. Those are starting to get a little more popular nowadays, so let's also give Laserdisc the eBay treatment. Wow, okay, here's a super nice looking one that's going for a cool five grand. And this is the Pioneer LD X1 reference model coming from Japan. So let's investigate a little further. Okay, now if we look at the photos, you'll see that although the player itself looks really nice, the camera they used to photograph this thing was probably a potato because I'm sure these low resolution photos really don't do this thing a justice, which is a shame. But crappy pictures aside, this thing does look pretty high quality. Now, is it worth five grand? I don't know. What do you think? I want you to let us all know down in the comments below. And if you like this unconventional video, join the vinyl revolution and hit subscribe because I'm gonna be coming out with a lot of great videos every week that you're not gonna wanna miss. Be sure to find me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and more. All of my social media links are in the description below. And most importantly, friends, have a great day and keep spinning that vinyl. Money can't buy happiness, but it can buy a lot of cool stuff.